Previously, the pietas, whether in paintings or in sculpture, were really just telling the biblical story of the Christ figure shown as having been crucified and now off the cross and in the arms of his mother. In this new approach, he universalizes it. He makes the subject less of just a biblical one, but of a presentation of great loss, of a mother mourning over her son. It became something that anyone could look at and be greatly moved by. It again continued the line in the Renaissance of moving towards realism. You, you really get a sense of, the, of this being a palpable person there and a sense of this tragic, broken body of Christ or of a man uh, as a, a being a real person. You stand in front of it and you, you can't but help have a sense of this is really this could have been a real person. There was also an idealism, and that was visible here because Christ's body, it's not a broken, bloody, beaten up body. It's this beautiful male form that just happens to be expired and contributes to the whole sense of loss of the, of the piece. The same thing is true with Mary. She's not portrayed at the age she would have been and the essentials here was that she was a pure, beautiful woman, and he was the son of God, uh, and the issues of his suffering weren't important to his view of the, of the subject. 